Welcome back, Chocolateites, to Would You Rock or Not? ESG was a direct replacement for the Les Paul in the early 60s. There are a few from late 1960, but 1961 is generally considered the first year. The new shape was still called a Les Paul until 1963 when Les's endorsement deal with Gibson ended. The guitar was finally renamed SG, which stands for Solid Guitar. Besides the shape difference between the two guitars, there was one other major wood change. A Les Paul standard had a maple top, whereas the new guitar did not. What would a SG look and sound like had they put one on it? In 2017, Gibson made a run of 50 SGs to answer that question. A maple top on an SG is a different sight, seeing as an SG is thinner than a Les Paul, doesn't have binding on the body, and is a little more contoured. This means that the joining of the maple top and mahogany back cannot be hidden by the binding like on a Les Paul. The side profile view of these guitars are actually very reminiscent of a 1970s pancake body. That is when Gibson used the mahogany maple mahogany sandwich of the woods for the body. Besides the top, this guitar is your standard Gibson historic reissue SG standard. It features a mahogany back, neck, and rosewood fretboard. The hardware is nickel and it sports an ABR1 bridge and custom bucker pickups. While this is a limited edition run of 50 guitars, there are a few currently on the market. Please check out these offerings from the three eBay sellers. The only question left, would you rock this maple top SG or not? Leave your answer down in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to see more of this series as well as reviews and demos which are posted every day. Thank you Troglodytes for watching and we will see you tomorrow on the next episode. Take care.